what's the experience like on the firm? The firm, honestly, and it's funny, I haven't talked about this very openly, but it's been a very difficult experience. Um, there was a, a dramatic creative difference between the, the main creator of the show and the actors that he hired. And so I think all of us have felt like it's been a, a long slog, to say the least, towards something that we're not... We don't believe it's what we would have loved to have been doing. You know, I think we felt like the show had creative possibilities that were sort of broken early on. And so, and that's been an incredible, difficult undertaking where you go to work every day on something that you try and get through as opposed to that you try and love, you know. And, and the, the job as an actor is such a rarefied and beautiful job, but the truth of the matter is oftentimes it's incredibly difficult because you pour your soul into something like we talked about early on. You risk putting yourself out there. Do you run the risk then of, of losing sight of what the moment on screen is supposed to be? I think that's the hard thing because when, you know, there are, I think there are times on anyone's job, look, I don't have an office job. I mean, that's the reality. Um, I, you know, I'm not, I'm, and I'm also not in the military, so I'm completely aware when people are out doing, you know, day-to-day -day mundane jobs that are necessary for the world or day-to-day -day jobs that are incredibly difficult and risky. And, and I think that as an actor, it's very hard to complain or say that what we do has any sort of um, real relevance to the world. So I think with the firm, we've all felt like the daily experience is probably much more like for what for most people is like going to a job. And that, you know, when, when your work, your life has been trying to stay out of having a job, <laughs> and then now you got a job. Uh, and so it's an interesting experience. What's, it's been, you're working with our, uh, a couple of Canadians, a couple of friends of ours, uh, Trish Helfer, and of course, Shama Jumder. What's it like working with Shama Jumder? He is, he is the exact opposite of what I'm talking about. <laughs> he is, and I mean that in the best sense of the world, that man is a, is a treat. You know, he's a, he's a great force of joy every day. Uh, he brings such a, he, he's like, to me, the experience that we've had, which has been quite interesting for all of us, is that we have had a group of actors that really love each other and take care of each other. And Sean has been kind of, at least for me, one of the best because he brings great humor to the set, which is otherwise a sort of oftentimes um, quite uh, trudging kind of day-to-day -day existence. <laughs> he, he, does, he does love to be there for others. When he found out that you were going to be on our show, uh, he, this is what came in. <laughs> With so many U.S. film productions coming to shoot in Canada, we Canadian actors need to be more prepared than ever. And with all the big roles going to American stars like Lou Diamond Phillips and Josh Lucas, I had to get over this crazy dream of mine of actually getting a speaking part. Hi, I'm Shama Jumder, head teacher at the Shama Jumder Technical Institute oh, of Faith Acting. Yeah. Students, acting isn't about speaking or listening or about truth. It's about acting with your face. Whether you're cop number two or male passerby or nosy janitor. The only way an agent will ever recognize you and point you out is with strong face acting. Here we go. Ready. Teacher gets shot. Panic ensues. Husband bursts through the door, sees him dying on the floor. And then, ha ha, it was a big prank for his 50th birthday. More, more face, more face, more face. Ready, teacher gets shot. Panic ensues. It's awesome. The wife bursts through the door, sees him dying on the floor. And then, it was a big prank for his 50th <laughs> birthday. Good. Shake out your face. Shake out your face. Shake out your face. <laughs> what, what, is the, what is the face acting part? <laughs> that, I, I, lo I love that you did that. That actually came from a particularly bad night on set where we were having to kind of do something like that, where this, the stakes were so ridiculous and over the top, and they kept getting bigger and bigger and bigger. So Sean said, I need to come up with a book where you just flip through and go to terrorist attack. That's the face. Let me show you. And so uh, he was going to give that school, and we were all going to do lessons. Or we were, you know what we were all going to do? We were going to basically do as if... You know, um, you know, Michael Caine says Sean Majumber's face acting school is the best he's ever been to. Uh, <laughs> Dude, that's got to go online. <laughs> that would do it.